Convert to radians, 160 degrees. You may have seen a couple of different ways to convert between radians and degrees. I like to memorize just one thing. If you remember that there are 180 degrees per pi radians, then you can convert back and forth between radians and degrees all day long. For example, 160 degrees is what we're starting with. And we're going to use actually something from a science class that's unit conversion, 160 degrees divided by 1. You can make anything into a fraction by putting it over 1. And now what do we want to cancel? We want to cancel the degrees, so we're going to put the degrees in the denominator. 180 degrees. We're always going to be multiplying by either this fraction or the reciprocal of this fraction. In this case, we're multiplying by the reciprocal of this fraction in blue. 180 degrees in the denominator so that the degrees will cancel out when we multiply these. And pi radians in the numerator. Now, the degrees cancel out and also we can simplify a little bit. S 160 divided by 180. We're going to put that as a, a fraction. Cancel the zeros out. Let's see. 2 goes into 160, or I'll say 20 goes into 160 um, 8 times, and 20 goes into 180 9 times. So we have 8 over 9. The degrees cancel out. We're left with radians. So this equals 8 over 9 pi. Typically, you put the pi in the numerator. So we could say 8 pi over 9 radians. And that is it for converting between degrees and radians. Now, between uh, radians and degrees, we have 3 pi over 4 radians. And if you're given a, a label like this, this radians, that is in the, the numerator. So 3 pi over 4 radians multiplied by, we're going to use this, this fraction, 180 degrees over pi radians. We want to cancel out the radians, so we'll put the radians in the denominator. So we'll, we'll just use that blue uh, fraction as it is. And we put 180 degrees in the numerator. The pi's cancel out. The radians cancel out. And we'll be left with just degrees. Let's cancel something out of the 4 and the 180. Let's divide a 2 out. So we've got 90 degrees over 2 here. And remember about the remember remember the the 3 here. We can cancel something else out. Hey, let's cancel a 2 all the way out. That becomes 45 up in the numerator. So we will not even need a decimal. 3 times 45 is Let's see, three times, 2 times 45 is 90, plus another 45 is 135. So 3 pi over 4 radians becomes 135 degrees. And if you look at a unit circle, you can see that relationship as well. All right, there it is, converting between radians and degrees.